twenty two days ago the red cross and the junior league blood center joined forces to collect blood for defense this is a new program not to be confused with the local blood program which has been going on for several years the blood you gave for defense is a special contribution for the armed forces and for use in a civil disaster which could be imminent in view of world conditions you receive no transfusion credit when you give to the blood for defense supply as you do when you give for local use you give blood for defense as a patriotic gesture to help save the lives of our fighting men and your own life for that matter too if there suddenly should be a national emergency here i regret to report that the blood for defense program is not being widely supported we are not even beginning to meet our minimum daily quota of forty eight pints of blood the department of defense and the national red cross report that the nation's reserve supply of plasma for men in combat is dangerously low and there is absolutely nothing for use in the event of a civil disaster the need for stockpiling is evident when we realize that the use of a single enemy high explosive in the Milwaukee area or any other large American city would require an immediate supply of no less than 200,000 units of plasma if the lives of only the less seriously injured are to be saved. After such an event, it might be too late to contribute any blood at all. I appeal to all of you to support this new and vital defense line, the Blood for Defense program. The staffs of both the Red Cross and the Blood Center have given their blood for defense. Follow their good example and call the Blood Center for an appointment. I'll even give you the telephone number, West 3, 5000. Let's support the blood for defense program.